Hey guys, welcome back to Meditex. Today we're going to be doing a price analysis on Everdome. Everdome is a Web3 game, a Mars simulator. Uh, it is a new, newer token. It's literally just one year old. Uh, so the information we have from the history books is pretty vague. Uh, definitely a cool token, worth checking out what they have going on. If you guys are new here, um, subscribe to the channel. I make daily videos on price analysis on, on coins that I think are interesting, that have long-term value. Um, if you have any questions, if you want me to do a review on a certain coin, please leave a comment down below. I read all the comments. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Uh, the coin, like I said, is new, and the, but we do have all of the moving averages now. The all-time high is um, right around the time the coin was incepted, which is uh, 0.003 cents. Before we go any further today, I want to invite you guys to check out the links down in the description. One link is to the Meditex Discord. We have lots of great players here using the projects you see we talk about on the channel. Jump into the Discord, jump into the conversation. I'm in here all the time. I'd love to chat with you guys. And also, check out the link to my OpenSea. These are all tokens I've created myself. They're very affordable. Purchasing them goes to help fund Meditex itself and also motivate me to make more videos in the future. November of 2022. So we are a little bit of a ways from there. The coin has dropped by, you know... Um, 80% since then, uh, although that would have been a nice time to get it right around there, huh? My gosh, it was 99% drop from the top there. Uh, but here we are, back on the rise, with an opportunity to uh, triple, triple up from the all-time high. <clears throat> um, first thing I'm observing here is that we are up against pretty strong resistance. Um, I'm going to mark it here. But you can see that this um, this line I just drew out has been resistance all the way through 2023. And uh, this is our first time touching it again since, you could even see over here, uh, we, we touched it on this wick. This is our first time touching it again since June of this year. That is a good sign, although it is going to be difficult to, to get over this point of resistance. How long will it take? I'm not exactly sure. Uh, this is just an analysis overall. I'm not Nostradamus. Uh, looking in a little bit more, we did just have a really good run-up, of course, and we are above the moving averages. What I will say is this seems realistic to me to where we test the moving average again. Uh, I, I, I think a lot of these coins are moving up before the end of the year. Um, so I'm going to mark it like that. I'm going to mark it like that. I see, I see we test it one more time and before the end of the year, going into 2024, we will get above this resistance. From there, the next point of resistance is in this range. And I'm going to draw another ray here, and we will make it a uh, dashed line. Uh, that is at the uh, zero, zero 002 cent mark. Um, and once we get above this resistance line, there's really not too much in between where we're at now and there. That should be a pretty easy mark to hit. Um, after that, who knows where the top is? Who knows where the top is? But we do have to stay above this line right now. Uh, we haven't gotten above it yet. And once we're there, we can look in a little bit deeper to see when we will get to this point. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. Dome, awesome project. Check it out. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments, and I'll see you guys on the next video.